Hey everybody, I'm Jeff Parker. Welcome to my channel. This is a Husky 62 inch adjustable workbench. This is one of my favorite, favorite tools, tables, workstations, whatever, in my garage. And I love my workstations. This thing is super versatile. I have not seen any reviews uh, on this workbench in particular. So it's very simple, very basic, uh, but its features are unlimited really. Um, one of the main, main features that stand out is its adjustable height. It's a crank style and as you can see, you just turn the crank, it runs a gear to both ends, and it goes up and down. Um, very, very cool. I'm a taller guy, I'm over 6'2", um, so I like to work on things at a, uh, you know, at a, at a nice height. Um, let me see if I can step back for you. So, I mean, that's, that's a pretty good height, um, you know, to work on anything in front of you. See if I can get a, uh, a measurement. So, from the ground to there is 46 and a half. And that's maxed out. It has a weight capacity of... 300 pounds so 300 pounds evenly uh, distributed across the uh, the whole thing um, I'll show you very simple you know it's it's a slower gear but you see with a little bit of effort it goes down pretty pretty quick see how low it goes now I don't want to confuse anybody when I say effort I didn't mean you know it turns very easily I just meant speed wise but, you know with the turn of one finger you can get it anyways <laughs> if this is your first time to my channel I haven't seen any of my reviews I'm kind of goofy but, um, so as you can see, it's like just under three feet, 35 and a half inches, um, is the low point. I will give you the item number. I'll put that in the description as well. It's uh, 1002-942-125. Um, this is a Home Depot item. What, uh, what you're looking at here is the brace. Now this brace is uh it's versatile also you can put it in the back here or you can put it in the center and i'll show you i have another one and i put it in the center there so <clears throat> either or uh you know it, it's all your preference it's actually designed or when they were advertising it it was so that this guy here in the middle could slide underneath of it so you, if you were limited on space this fits perfectly underneath of here and this also this is a 52 inch adjustable height uh, your workbench slash toolbox but that's for another review I actually did a quick review on that. <clears throat> um, so, I'll pause this video, and when I come back, I'll show you uh, how I utilize this and why I put the, um, the brace in the back. So, we're back, and I repositioned everything. Space in my garage is tight. Um, 
So when I want to pull the vehicle in and work on it in here, I move everything over here. It's the beauty of the, uh, you know, the table. It also has locking casters down there, which allow it to lock in place. And because the brace is in the back, I can slide three carts underneath of there and keep everything nice and compact. My detailing cart here, my tool cart there, my table here, and I can work on anything I want up here. Um, this is an all round excellent table, underrated, and uh, the cost varies. Um, right now, it's on Home Depot's website for $249, but it goes on sale often for uh, $199, and um, sometimes it goes even cheaper than that. So, like if you get um, a 10% off um, discount, and the $199, obviously, you know, it's cheaper, but... You know, I have a workstation here, and those uh, benchtop tools, they, they switch off and on um, as I'm working on different things, grinder, buffer, uh, scroll saw. <clears throat> and what's nice is, is you can line them up anywhere you want. You can, I've taken it outside and worked on something outside. The, you know, wheels work really good. So again, uh, this is a great product, absolutely one of my favorite. I actually own three. Uh, the other one we keep in the basement uh, in the laundry room to fold clothes on. So my wife loves it, I love it, I think you'll love it. This is the SKU number. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks.